Ladies and gentlemen, it is your lovely host here. Once again, it is Team Rai. Have you seen the very first video of the day? If not, smash that bell. You will get a notification from YouTube. Now, I do have social media accounts. And I will discuss that more details about it after this part of the video is over. So, once again, sit back, relax, put your feet up, grab some meat, or grab some drink, or maybe, just maybe, you want to chill like a villain and hear my lovely thoughts, my amazing opinions on this subject. And, of course, the article will be down below, or the link will be down below. This one, there will be a link. Now, a lot of you are very disappointed that that we decided to get rid of Keith Lee. You know, he came back at one time, and then out of nowhere, they released him, okay? You know, what if they never released him? Can this guy be a main event in WWE's atmosphere? Can he win the Rumble? Can he win the Money in Bank? Can he be a great heel? We will never know. They release him way too quickly, you know? I know he's got he was off TV. Sorry, I close this. He was off TV for a while. I guess he had health issues. I don't know. He had the virus. I don't know what to believe anymore. You know, I know he had like an interview not that long ago, and then W said, "You know what? We have to release you." And I think at the time they say it was budget cuts. I still don't believe it to this day. Now, listen to this. The former W superstar Keith Lee doesn't seem to be interesting in the return to W, and he doesn't want the fans to think they be seem seeing him any any seeing him there any time soon. I don't blame him. Don't come back. There's no reason because you know what's gonna happen. They will release you. So you better off in the AEW and other wrestling companies. You know. They didn't want to treat you correctly, especially on the main roster. Especially, you know, it, it was a bad time, in my opinion, to release him or any of these superstars. This guy could be a major player in the WWE scene, but no, they decided to release you. So, like I said before, it's W's loss and another wrestling company a gain. You know, look at me, people that who who are former WWE superstars, got released, and don't want to work for WWE anymore. And guess what? AEW just swooped them up and used them in the correct way. You know? WWE, you guys are so dumb. You are keep saying the reason we're releasing these guys are budget cuts. Like I said in my other videos in the past, I still don't believe it. They made so much money during the pandemic. So this is just another excuse. Now, I'm not a fan of the Thunderdome. It was doggy doo-doo. I mean, at first it was okay, but after months and months and months, it got, it sucked. Now, maybe that's why, in my opinion, of course, my opinion does not matter. Because if my opinion matters, people will like my opinions, but a lot of you don't like my opinions, but whatever. Anyway, I think they should not release them because it was during the, the whole pandemic, and they were, at the time, they were still in the Thunderdome. I don't know if he, he wrestled in live crowds for WWE, maybe for a short time. So this guy could have some great rivalries, you know? Great matches. I don't know if he... Had, I forgot, what kind of match did he had during the Thunderdome? Not not many, not many great matches. I mean, not great. I'm sorry. <clears throat> I mean, he had some good matches, but not as much like people want to see, you know. So I do apologize. And his girlfriend got released not that long ago. People got bent out of shape. People, this is W we talk about. W does not want to make new stars for some stupid reason. They want to keep the same guys over and over and over. You know, they could bring in new talent, but that does not mean they're gonna be major superstars. They gotta work their way 
weigh up or kiss a major butt behind the scenes, you know? And I guarantee some of these ladies and some of these guys do kiss up to make man over the years. I guarantee they did. They did. I just know it. I get that tea. Or they do the old fashioned way of working their butts off in, in the rankings and then finally be a main eventer. I could be totally right in that part or totally wrong on the other part. Who knows? You know, no one does not know what's really behind the scenes. Only the people who really work behind the scenes. You know what I'm saying? Okay, I know I don't make no sense, but you guys gotta deal with my videos or don't watch my videos anymore. Anyway, have a good one. Like, subscribe, if you come hit the notification, hit the subscribe. All my social media accounts will be down below. Follow me on Instagram, Twitch, Twitter, TikTok. All my social media accounts, like I said, will be down below. If you really want to be part of the Rob Rob Show, the link will be down below. Down below, click the link. DM me. DM me. Apologize. We could uh, discuss any kind of topic you please. Now, if you like the gaffa, what is this, you know? So, that's it. We could discuss about the passing of John Madden. We could discuss about... The Spider-Man Spider -Man movie, if you've seen it, if you've not seen it, we discuss a lot of great movies coming out in 2022 and other great stuff. So please message me for a crying loud. Thank you very much and have a good Wednesday and I'll talk to you tomorrow. Deuces. Yeah.